The top 10 players who were available on a bunch of waiver wires from Monday's action in the NBA. Gary Harris was at number one. I don't think we need to do much with that in terms of adding to fantasy rosters. But at number two on that list was Jalen McDaniels. The Hornets don't play till Friday. He's interesting. Long term, I don't see it, but interesting in the short term. Ish Smith was at three, don't care. Four was Jalen Noel. Yeah, with Towns out, maybe. Five was Nembhard. I like that for 14-team leagues. Six, Jeremiah Robinson Earl. He's just a deeper league guy. Sam Hauser, similarly. Same with Aaron Neesmith. Number nine was Teo Maladon. Yeah, maybe. That's only if all those players on the Hornets are out um, and they don't play till Friday. And then at number 10 is Will Barton. And that's an absolutely huge no thanks for me. They're the top waiver wire producers who are available in a vast amount of leagues that you might consider adding. There's not many of them there who are great ads, but someone like a Jalen McDaniels or a Jalen Noel, and of course, Kyle Anderson with the Towns injury, they are options for you to add to your team.